Great, here we go. So coming off of the automatic transmission uh, Honda NC700 DCT and going to the uh, automatic transmission, but a different way, the FJR 1300 AE. All right, let's see what happens here. All right. Uh, so it weighs much more. <laughs> you can feel the weight. All right. And then remember, turn, yep. turn on that one. Uh, and turn on this one because it's off right now. And it's, a green, it's green to go. It's got a green light. If it doesn't go green, you can't shift. Right. Interesting. All right, there we go. We'll see you back here in a couple of minutes. All right. Automatic transmission, so I'm going to shift here. Okay, that's second, that's third, fourth, All right? Very nice. Let me try turn signaling here. Cancel it. Apply the brake. Wow, very cool. Okay, now it's in fourth. Now it's in third. Now it's in second. Alrighty, I got gotcha. you. Wow, oh, back on the FJR after all these years. Oh yeah, it seems like if I back off the throttle a little bit, it works better. Raising the windshield, electric height, there it is. Oh, that feels pretty good. So it's basically, it's a manual shifting bike just without the clutch, but you do have to, I didn't know that, you have to pull off the uh, off the accelerator, just uh, off the throttle a little bit for a nicer, smoother shift. Although I suppose you could just power shift to it if you wanted to. Is that lane open? Ooh, ooh, that lane's open, yay! Remember to downshift. Oh, those brakes are good. Let's see what this baby can do. That's pretty good. That's a lot of fun. U turn. Ooh, nice. I'm getting the hang of this. over there. Hello! Just like the DCT, you can't really rev the throttle when you're in stopped mode in second gear. That wouldn't be good. I forgot how wide the seat was on this. I think on my FJR I had a Corbin saddle. Yeah, time for a U-turn. Look at me. That is so much fun. That is amazing. Yeah, that's great.